In Battery Park City, there's a new exhibition at the Museum of Jewish Heritage called The Holocaust, What Hate Can Do. It's a presentation of history told through personal stories. CBS 2's Steve Overmeyer has a look at some personal items on view for the very first time. And remember, these people saved it from 1939 onward because this represented the quest for freedom for them. Michael Berenbaum is the curator of this exhibit. We're standing in front of the memorabilia from the MS St. Louis, a ship full of Jewish people seeking asylum. They were turned away from the shores of America and sent back to Europe to endure the Holocaust. As it went back, the cruise turned from a cruise of freedom into a cruise of going back to doom and death. More than 750 artifacts are on display at the Holocaust exhibit to educate. Countless personal stories of the beginning of the journey and too many of the end. And remember, Eva kept this teddy bear her entire life. She kept it her entire life because this was the last remnant she had of her home. It's painful for a Holocaust survivor to relive this experience, but Alice Ginsberg came to speak for those with no voice. They want the world to know that this should not happen again. It's been 77 years right, since right, right. the Holocaust. What has humanity learned in that time? Unfortunately, they haven't. And, uh, and there's so much indifference and there's danger indifference. There's a renewed focus on the Holocaust amid a rash of hate speech and hate crimes. This exhibition is meant to help people reflect on the consequences of hate. Well, we live in a world in which this unfortunately has echoes to our world. And we have to remind people that we've told you this story not to weaken you, but to strengthen you. And now it's up to you. In Battery Park City, Steve Overmeyer, CBS2 News. The exhibition, The Holocaust, What Hate Can Do, is at the Museum of Jewish Heritage through November.